Good morning. So I got back from California yesterday. I took a red eye on Sunday night. Got to Jersey. Sunny New Jersey. It was like monsooning at about 6 a.m. I kind of like a red eye. Did not sleep at all, but it worked out with my schedule. Also, fantastic to come home to a freshly made bed. Like, I dove right in there. Um, so, pro tip, clean your room, make your bed before you leave for a trip. Um, so, I am currently at Walmart. Today is the 18th. Is it? Wait, it might be the 19th. I wish I knew it the 19th. Yeah, it's the 19th. So, I have my Angel Tree gifts um, ready to drop off, kind of, because I ordered, um, one of my little boys wanted a specific remote control car, um, and I ordered it, like, December 1st. Online, my FedEx tracking still says it hasn't moved, and it's in, like, Red Bank, New Jersey, and I'm like, I'll just drive to you and come get it, but, like, that's not how things work, so I looked, and, um, in store at Walmart, um, it's available here, and what I like about this, it tells you the aisle, because, I would easily get lost in a Walmart, so came down to Walmart. I'm going to get his little remote control car, pop it in the bag. Actually, these bags are really small, so I might get a bag while I'm here, too. Um, then I'm going to head to the mall. I have my torrid bras that did not fit me, um, so I'm going to do a little even exchange, and knowing me, I will probably get something from the clearance rack. I do have a $15 reward, so whatever I get, very well may be free. Um, also, while I'm at the mall, I'm going to see, oh yeah, I need my Sephora birthday freebie and my Ulta birthday freebie. And then I think um, Panera, like there's got to be some other food freebie that I can still get. So that'll be my lunch. Um, I actually haven't done any of my freebie stuff because my birthday was Friday, December 8th. Then I left for California the 10th um, and I intended on feeding myself while I was in California with my freebies and stuff, but like work fed us enough and also like there's so much good stuff in California that I was like I will hold off on getting my Cheesecake Factory slice um just because I'm eating so many like tacos and stuff here so I still have a bunch to use so that'll keep me fed for the next week um but yeah thank god they don't expire and root oh my god I do need to buy a new phone this week at some point I need to leave my house again um and buy a new phone but I this week is pretty packed too so I'm gonna do my stuff at Walmart do my stuff at the mall work. There's a spin class I want to take tonight. It's Olivia Rodrigo themed and I have fully joined the Olivia team. Um, but I don't really like driving at night. So we'll see if I get there, but that's the plan. All right. Adventure Force Racer acquired. So when that other one finally comes, I'll just get a refund for that or maybe give it to my 10 year old cousin. We will see. Um, this is massive though. And like, this is the size of the bags I have. So I don't think it's gonna fit in there. Plus I also got him other stuff. Um, luckily I have a third bag, so we will see. And I don't know how to attach the name tag to it. So hopefully there's someone who can help at the mall. Guys, I wish I got what happened on film. So I had the three giant bags of my gifts. I get out into the parking lot. I can barely hold everything. The slip that says the family and like who it's for, flies away into the wind of the parking lot. I didn't even see where it went. It went like whoosh in my face and then just out into the universe. So I put everything down in the parking lot, trying to like look where I can get it fully gone. Thank God I looked at the number right before I left. So it was number 49. Um, so I get in, I drop the first one off. It's all tied up. Nice. Now I'm paranoid. I'm like, what if it unties? Um, because then after that, I went into a toy store and I'm like, hey, do you have a Sharpie so I can write number 49 on this? They looked at me like I had five heads. I was like, Sharpie. They're like, and I was like, a marker? And she was still like, so I just left. I didn't even say like, oh, no, thank you. I left. Um, so I went to Torrid because those girls have brains and I also had to exchange the bra. So I was like, hey, I'm going to, I'm going to patronize your business, but can I have a marker? And they, they got it. They knew what was going on. Um, so I just wrote number 49 on every side of the bags, and I hope that's okay. Um, I also tried to write it on the toy, but the box was also very black. So I'm hoping everything works out, because I did spend a lot of money, and I would love for those kids to actually get their gifts. Um, I took down the email of the uh, angel tree thing, and I'm going to email them and be like, by the way, I wrote number 49 on the outside. Like, I'm so paranoid now. Um, but yeah, I exchanged my bra at Torrid. I didn't get anything. Uh, nothing really tickled me. They have some good stuff online right now, and the sales are good. I do have my $15 off, so I got to, like, strategically 
see how I want to use that. Um, I was also going to go to Old Navy and exchange something, but the line was really long in there, and I was like, I have to go to work. Um, also, I went to Sephora for my birthday reward, and she's like, we're all out. You can have points. And I'm like, I don't shop here enough to, like, use the points. Um, so I'm either going to doink around... New Jersey she did say she was very helpful she's like go to the Sephora inside of Kohl's one most people don't know they're there and two they're gonna have the birthday rewards so great tip from that girl um I also have an Ulta reward but by the time I was like in the middle of the mall I'm like Ulta's all the way back there I didn't want to walk so um I did fake a birthday at Chick-fil-a so that's gonna be my my new birthday is on Thursday, so I'm gonna come back probably end of the week, get my Chick Fil A birthday gift, and then I'll go to Ulta, um, and exchange that old navy thing. So, a trip back is in order. Um, I am late for work, but I do want to plow my face, so I'm kind of debating. I'm like, do I want? Where is anything I own? Okay, I'm so scatterbrained. Found the phone. Um, Popeyes or Chipotle. I'm leaning more towards Chipotle, but Popeyes is right there, so we will see. But wait, a birthday reward I did get, my kitchen sink cookie. It is massive from Panera, so very happy about that. And I ended up at Chipotle. Look how fat this is. I'm so jazzed. My pants do not fit. Hello, poor lighting because Law & Order is on right behind you and that's how I'm getting lit. Um, I'm currently getting ready for trivia. We've been going on and off like every Wednesday for the past couple months and it's always my brother initiating. Actually this light is annoying me. It's always Scott initiating. He went back to California as I was coming back to Jersey. Um, and Erica can never make it. Like she's always at a wedding or traveling for work. And I got a text this morning in the group chat and Erica's like trivia tonight and we're all like you have to be joking. Like you're always the one who can never make it. So. We're going. It's going to be me, Erica, Mikey, and Lizzie. Um, Lizzie is Mike's niece, um, and she just turned 21. And I'm like, we literally were, like, doing your diapers when we were in eighth grade, and now you're going to be at the bar with us. So that's going to be a mind trip for me. Um, I have, like, a mid outfit on. I'm also debating on if I want to do my face, because it's just going to be, like, a bunch of townies. But, like, I don't know. I feel like if I have, like, real clothes on, might as well put a light face on. I wanted to do my fun mod cloth sweater, cannot find it. Also, I cannot find anything in my room. I have a giant table in here, like literally a beer pong table. Naturally piles everywhere, closet exploding, like that is my life right now. So, sorry about the floorboards. Let's focus. Um, dirty mirror, the huge. So I got my old navy jeans on, smile crotch, <laughs> and then a is this Shein or Timu? I don't know. A little caramel sweater. Very cute. Um, but yeah, very basic. I, I want to be wearing sparkles. It's Christmas week. Last week, Scott and Mike went to trivia and they said it was all Christmas themed. So I'm hoping it's the same tonight because I feel like I would slay a Christmas theme. Um, but yeah, let's see if I feel like putting a face on. All right, I did it. This is a light face. And by light face, I mean foundation, a little blush that's not really picking up, so I might put on more, and mascara. So no eyeliner, I look dead, and no eyebrows, no bronzer, no contour. Big old basketball head, but again, it's kind of a townie night. Watch me meet my husband. All right, so I know you can barely see me, but someone was like, oh, put on a coat just in case you have to walk. And I was like, I'm not drinking there. Their beer is ass at this brewery. Um, they do have their own root beer, which I get sometimes, but even that is mixed bad. Like, this is not a good brewery, and I don't really love going there for trivia because I don't have food either. So it's not like I can even get, like, a combo platter, but the ambiance is good, and their sound system is better than the bar we usually go to for trivia, which does have mozzarella sticks. So it is kind of a trade-off, but you know what? I wasn't in charge tonight. If I were to plan trivia night, we're going to the one with the combo platter. Okay, I should have brought a coat. Hello, it's 4.30 in the morning. I'm going to spin class. So it's CJ's last class and she only teaches at 5.45. So I'm up and about. This is the only person I'll do this for. Um, should end around 6.30, then I figured I'd go to my other job till nine, come back here, probably crash, um, but then work on my real job for the rest of the day and then yoga at 7 p.m. So today's gonna be a long day. Also, it is pitch black outside. It will 
still be pitch black when I'm driving out there. Um, but yeah, this is probably the last time I'll ever have to do this. I did it, I survived a 5.45 a.m. workout. And you know what? I had more energy for that than when I do like a 9.30 a.m. workout. So riddle me that. I was like, maybe I should do this more often. But again, Cycle Bar is about 25 minutes away from me. So adding in the drive time, not worth it. But I did have a really good workout this morning. It's like 9 a.m. now, so I've been up for a while probably crash at like noon. I do have hot yoga later, so I'm in my universal standard onesie, so I'm ready for yoga in nine hours? I don't know math. Um, but I figured I would go to TJ Maxx. Yikes, I know, because going shopping right before Christmas is probably insane. Um, but I just need a few things. I'll probably spend $80. Uh, we're having a you know, white elephant at my uncle's house on Christmas. The theme is kitchen. So I usually buy what I want, hoping to get that item. So I want one of those things you put like your onion in and then you go like, Psh, and it cuts the onion for you. Um, so I want like a little vegetable cutter. We'll see if TJ Maxx has that. If not, I'll get whatever I find and call it a day. And then for our Christmas party on Christmas Eve, just like a regular, no themed, kind of white elephant, so I'll probably do a Starbucks gift card. And again, hope that I win that. Um, trivia last night was great. I pretty much took over the reins. It was Christmas themed, so I was on a roll. Um, we lost the last question. I don't remember what it was. But there was even some things like, you know, like the 12 days of Christmas, it's like, okay, what's 9, 10, 11, and 12? It's like Lords of Leap and Ladies Dance and all that stuff. Somehow I pulled those two out of my brain. I don't know anything like to do with accounting, but I do know those things. Um, so we did pretty good up until the last question, but you know what, we had fun, we had pizza, it was all good. So yeah, a few more errands to do. I, ha I still have a lot of work to do work-wise, um, and <laughs> my brain is just not there, but I'm gonna try and push through, maybe take an Adderall. I only have two left, so we'll see. Um, and then someone just texted me and they said, what are you doing? I hate that. You need to lead with like whatever you want for me because no one's really texting me to be like, hey, thinking about you. It's they want me to like babysit or dog sit for free. Um, You got to lead with like, hey, I'm going to the movies later. Do you want to come? Not with like a what are you doing? Because like that can go 50-50. Also, I hate not having 24 hours notice for things. Um, So I'm kind of like on edge of when this text will come back because I said I'm doing nothing. So, oh, I don't feel like leaving my house. I, obviously, I'm gonna go shopping and go to yoga, but like, I don't feel like being social. Um, I'm just like, not there yet. So, hopefully they just wanted to say hi, but probably not. Um, but yeah, gonna go to TJ Maxx. Hopefully I don't have a meltdown in the parking lot. I thought my bangs and my hair would settle down. I look insane. This TJ Maxx is the only thing keeping this shopping center in business. Okay. The deed is done. Also, you know you're a millennial when you're like, oh, this is a nice bag. So I never made it to Starbucks just because I was like, okay, I'm already in TJ Maxx. Let's just like get it all done in one spot. Um, and I saw this. And we, everyone who's coming, Betty, hi. Come in. Good girl. Hi. Okay, everyone who's coming to my house on Christmas Eve usually comes camping with us. Um, so I was like, okay. This will go over well with the camping squad. So it is a um, wireless speaker, cooler, chair. Um, probably more so of like a little end table, you know, for us. But like, it has everything we need. This one was $35, which was a little more than I was planning on spending, but this will get used. I am hoping people fight over this. And it'll go over well with the crowd. Hi, I'll pick you up. Hey, I'll pick you up. Oh, oh, cute girl alert. Hi. Okay, you wanna go to the bed? I love you. Okay, okay. Okay. Um, these I just got for myself. So they are plastic straws just to have. Went to Wendy's last night. Um, health nut and the paper straw just deteriorated. So I got some of these. I'll keep them in my car. I'll keep them around the house. Um, they're like a pale pastel. Cute. And then... For the kitchen gift. I couldn't find 
what I'm gonna call, it's not a slap chop, but I couldn't find the vegetable cutter. So then I thought, my sister mentioned that she wanted a lettuce cleaner? Courtney lives in California now, so she won't be at this Christmas. But I was like, if that's something people want, and I kinda want it too, then I think it'll be a good gift. So I got a salad spinner, and then to go with that, I got a magic bullet. I have a magic bullet, I love it, so I figured we'd put these two together. And again, I'll try and fight for this as well, cause why not have another magic bullet? So that's what I got for the white elephants. That's pretty much the only gifts I'm buying this year. We don't need to do gifts in my family. But then this year my mom's like, what do you want for Christmas? And I already got those headphones from work, um, and that's kinda what I wanted. I would probably just get it myself because it's not screwed up when you do it yourself. Um, but then my mom's like, okay, what do you want for Christmas? And I was like, you know what? There were some things in my cart at Sephora, um, so why not have my mom just pay for it? So even instead of having her get it, I was like, just give me your credit card and I'll do it so I can get the points and coupon. Like, I will extreme coupon for you and use Rakuten. Um, so I just got um, the First Aid Beauty Facial Radiance Pads, so a... I'm at a loss for words today. A little chemical exfoliant to get off the dead skin cells. I've had these for a couple years. I really like them. I don't use them every day, but just to like refresh your face. And then this Sol de Janeiro like body spritz. My sister has all of them and I smelled them when I was in California and I was like, I think 68 is my favorite. So a nice sweet smell. And I toyed with the idea of getting the mini, but then I'm like, my mom's paying for it, so I'm gonna get the big one. So that's what I got from Sephora. And I did the Kohl's Sephora, and you can still get your Sephora points when you do Kohl's at Sephora, and you can also use the Kohl's, like, discounts, so it was just better this way. Um, I did mention the other day I went to regular Sephora, they didn't have the birthday gift, and she's like, try the Kohl's Sephora. They didn't have the birthday gift either. So I'm like, what do I do? The joys of being born in December, everyone's run out of things. Um, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. Um, I guess there's a few more Sephora's and I could like drive into New York State, um, but I figured I'd maybe call ahead and ask before I do that. Um, I do have one more thing to show you. I just ordered these, I think like around Black Friday. Let me get a big scissor. So CalPAC is like a luggage company and I have two of their Luca duffels. Um, they're huge, they fit under the seat in the airplane, they're great carry-ons um, and they fit a ton. And again, it's rare for me to spend a good amount of money on something, and those are each like a hundred bucks, and I got two. Um, so I've been getting like the emails, and nothing's like tickling me, and I don't need another duffel bag. I look so bad right now. Um, but around Black Friday and my birthday, they're like, you have like a five dollar voucher. I'm like, let's let's look around, see if I can get like five dollars off something small. And free shipping was around, you know, like 40 bucks. So I was like, I don't mind spending a little bit of money to get the free shipping and using my five dollar off, you know? And then once I checked out, it's like, you have a lot of points. Do you want to use them towards your transaction? I'm like, sure. I had like $35 worth of points. So this was essentially free for what I got. Um, so the first thing I got, and this is what I was going to use the five dollars off on, this retails for like 19 and then five dollars off, obviously. I was like, hmm, 14 bucks. Okay. Portable charger luggage tag. So it's a luggage tag and a charger, so it has all the hardware in there. So obviously I got the mauve pink. Inside it has the rechargeable thing. Pop this cord in here, pop your phone like six inches away, easy. Also, functioning luggage tag. So with the amount I've been traveling this year, good to have, and I always need a portable charger. So I have that, and I think I'm gonna order a few more off Amazon just to have in my purse. I always need a charger. Um, and then I just got two um, laptop cases. I have one um, that I use for work, and I think I just sized it a little off, and I have some like extra things that I plug into the side of my work computer, so it doesn't really fit with those on it. Uh, and then I had one from Five Below forever. And I have no idea where it is. So I got a smaller one for my personal computer, my MacBook. So cute little black and white polka dot. And then this one's for work, nice and big. This one will fit my computer with all its attachments and a nice little light pink. Fits with my personal aesthetic and my current skin color. I look like a pig right now. But yeah, this was essentially free because all the points I had and I didn't know I had. So always a fun little surprise when you're checking out. Okay, I think we will wrap up the vlog here. I feel like I probably looked like I'm under house arrest or I live in my car, but I swear I do do things. Happy holidays if I don't see you. Uh, Merry Christmas and I will we'll do, a, we'll end this with a little shot of Betty because she's a cutie and I can't get this out. Ugh.
Hi, baby. Hi. We got to change her into her Christmas dress and your Christmas scarf. You are so cute. I love you. Say bye. Bye-bye.